Nessa, now is literally not the time. Right now, I, I do not need you going ahead and, and, and spending your time haunting our gemstones. Thank you very much. Where are Nessa? Where are you? Nessa? Nessa, come back here. All right. The ghost is here somewhere. She just decided to go ahead and bounce around inside of this amethyst piece. That's, I guess, fine. Maybe not. Maybe it's fine. But we kind of have some things going on. Some things that have a fairly fair, actually. Fairly, fairly, actually. <laughs> gone ahead and uh, made Ashlyn a little bit embarrassed. Because, you see, we may have gone ahead and we may have, um made a bit of a boo-boo accident to whoopsie with uh, her alien powers. So I gave this a lot of thought and then more thought, trying to understand the implications of the fact that just after Ashlyn went ahead and she literally adopted, you know, Rocky's kids, who might actually also be her kids since she doesn't remember what happened before, you know, she crash landed. I... Can't believe it, but she turned around and she wiped Rocky's memories of her. Clean. Like whoosh. Like what was that? <laughs> what was that? And I gave it a lot of thought and I decided after more thinking and then finally deciding I just needed to start wording and maybe my wording would tumble together and make a plot that that is one of the um the mysteries of aliens uh abducting people in our simlish worlds and then returning them with no memory uh, solved and i actually don't think it's malicious i actually think ashlyn just got that excited that you know she hasn't been to 6am and she's wanted to be to 6am for a long time she has been wanting to make out with rocky for forever and they haven't she just adopted the kids she has gotten engaged to rocky so i think what happened is that from ashlyn's point of view she was thinking about how this is a new stage in their relationship adopting the kids kind of looking at them being like whoa hold up being a mom like that's not a concept where she's from so she's really kind of adapting to that and thinking it's a whole new relationship with rocky and if you kind of mix together that and the fact that she hasn't been to six am in a long time uh and then you know the fact that she has been in her human form and not her alien form in a very long time i think it was an accident like there was just some crisscrossing of biological wires and her thoughts about it being a new stage of the relationship kind of ended up going yeah it's like everything's brand new and, and it ended up wiping rocky's memory yeah i don't think she did it on purpose to say the very least <laughs> and so now i am trying to figure out what to do with a man who apparently has all the energy in the world because oh my gosh that ring is like broken good um and you know he's he's also realizing like um there's a strange woman in his house there's a strange woman in his house with his child. What do we do about that? <laughs> so I think I think he's kind of like still a bit dazed um, and kind of still a bit like, whoa, what just happened? But let's see if we can actually maybe perhaps if we're super duper lucky, salvage this because, oh, kiss goodnight, kiss goodnight. I've never seen the infants be kissed goodnight. <gasps> oh my gosh, because I think he's like kind of still oh that was so cute that was so cute <laughs> i think he's still kind of like in the stunned phase of things let's put fiona to sleep as well and then i think that ashlyn is going to try to maybe let's see should she remove her disguise um maybe she wouldn't do that right away because i think rocky's gonna go ahead oh boy Will the kids even go to sleep? I have no idea. I hear that, Nessa! Nessa, where are you? Wait. That's not Nessa. Are you kidding me? What?
My ghost is getting abducted by aliens. The ghost of Rocky's cousin. Who I was about to say Ashlyn was going to try to talk to and summon and maybe even be able to revive so that Nessa can show up and be like, no, no, Rocky, yeah, seriously, she really is like your fiance. I kind of just met her, but Nessa's been watching everything as a ghost for a while now. Um, she's kind of been, you know, away a little bit. What? I think, at least now, um... Are you kidding? I didn't know ghosts could be abducted by aliens. Well, Nessa's about to find out just how real, you know, the alien thing is firsthand. And I have a lot of questions about who is abducting her and how that hopefully we can answer shortly. I... This is truly the first time I in ever, ever, ever ever, 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 I have had a ghost abducted by aliens. Like, there's... I need a spot. Who are you? I don't have time for anything more. Stay back. Don't mess with my goats, please. I need a spot. I can go. That treehouse, maybe? Erwin's not using it. He's terrified of the dark and said aliens did give him a good spookin and he doesn't want to sleep in his treehouse until there's lights installed on it. But I need a spot I can just go and, like, sit for a little while to kind of... kind of interpret all of this. But we're gonna just keep wording and see what happens. So, Rocky, after you kiss the girls goodnight, I think he is going to go ahead and he's going to do maybe a flirty introduction because he's feeling passionate. So he's apparently still utterly enamored with Ashlyn and he's still like completely in, in romantic, like deep love with her. He just is also really confused. All of his emotions are probably going all over the place. And at least he can introduce himself while the kids are going ahead and crying and you know, our ghost just got abducted by aliens. I don't... I, I, I'm just along for the ride at this point. I don't need to do anything more. Also, Rocky has now reached charisma level 4. Rocky can perform a smooth apology and a cheerful introduction to other sims, which is adorable. Ashlyn, how are you maybe chatting? I mean, that's a good bit of romance, but... Oh my gosh, and are the kids still upset? What was this quirk? I've never seen works before. So snuggly sleeper. Alani prefers to fall asleep while being held. Infants with the snuggly sleeper quirk cry when they're being put down to sleep. Even if they're being soothed, they prefer to sleep while either being held or in a back carrier. Each infant is different from the next and has three infant quirks that can be discovered over time. To read more about Alani's new- oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Okay. She's cautious and she really likes being cuddled to go to bed. Um... Is she going to go ahead and try to go to bed without us, though? Because this is kind of a huge deal. And I think Rocky is feeling flirty, but also confused. And he's like, whoa, something's happening. Uh, okay, do we have, like, a gift we can give him? Because we also still have to complete our community service day. I need, like, 800 lie downs. Uh, you know, they don't even... Wait, no, they do have, they do have a, a, a selfie with each other. They do, they do. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. Where is it, where is it? I know I stored that, that thing somewhere. I know I did. Okay, open, create frameless print. Oh my gosh. Okay, I, I swear there is a picture of them. I think it's in Rocky's own inventory. It is, is that with Ashlyn? Okay, that's not Ashlyn, that's some random guy. There's Ashlyn, oh my gosh. I was so worried for a second. Okay, let's have them come over here and she can kind of be like, no, look, see, that's us. Um, and I'm sorry. And then maybe she can take off her like alien appearance and we can kind of work on that. Uh, also, you two, if you could please like make a group and the kids are going to have to just, I'm so sorry, babies. Like, I don't think that Rocky's happy about this, but he's going to try to let them go to sleep on their own for just a minute as I back away from the crying. Come on, Rocky. 
he wants to go ahead and flirt with Ashlyn, so I think his wires are all mixed up too. He's just like, well, I'm feeling something. I just don't know what's going on. Also, like, there was a weird noise outside. Oh, Fialona is also a snuggly sleeper. What am I going to do? I need more rocking chairs. I need more of a lot of things. Let's appreciate together this picture. Maybe that'll, maybe this will help. Maybe this will do it. Rocky? Okay, please don't, don't disappear randomly on me. I, 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 we've already got all this going down. Um, all right, and then let's go ahead and then maybe we're going to create a copy of this, please. And then we'll give him the, the copy as a gift. Rocky is feeling really flirty with her, at least. And then, there we go. So let's go ahead and maybe give him, uh, can it be a romantic gift? Affection? Um, maybe, if it, like, you have my heart or something to be like, no, no, no. <laughs> like, discuss future together? Discuss relationship status? I mean, it's kind of a, a blank slate at this point, ma'am. Um, let's go ahead and give him a picture. I'm so glad they have at least one picture Very together. Well. Oh my gosh, am I going to be investing in a camera and being like a shutterbug with this family? Because apparently I need to do that just to keep us, like, around? Alright, there you go. It's a picture of each other, what do you think? I think he liked it. That's sweet. Does he get the rose? Oh. <gasps> He's like, whoa, I just, like, I happen to have this rose back. Like, I think he's just really confused at the moment. Um, but, you know, he's like, okay, is this, like, a prank? Like, did you Photoshop this picture of us together? Uh, also, why are you in my house, by the way? The, the kids, like, are you the nanny? Are you, like, the babysitter? Uh, what's going on here? By the way, have you seen my cousin Nessa? <laughs> She's in space. How am I going to get my ghost out of space? Oh my word. Uh. Oh. Kids. <laughs> so there we go. Rocky gave Ashlyn a gift. Every day we spend together, we're creating our own fairy tale. I look forward to creating our happily ever after. Well now it's like that 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 movie where you forget everything the next day, sir. Oh boy. Okay, let's see. Well, now she's done that, and then he actually has a gift for her too that he was working on before all of this happened. Um, let's see. Can we go ahead? I don't think I can even give her a romantic gift. That sucks. Uh, okay. Gift. Can we not gift jewelry? Um, no, Rocky's jewelry. Oh, oh, I forgot. Okay. So Rocky actually did make her something. And I think we'll go ahead and give it to her. It's this beautiful botanical necklace that happens to be made out of the same gemstone that he's wearing that's making him feel so good. Uh, where is it charged? Let's check. Okay, it's got like four days worth of charge on it. That's better than nothing. And this botanical neck ne necklace is made with a planthium and plumbite, and it increases your needs slowly over time and makes other sims around you happy, which is amazing. And the thing is, it was, it, we'll give it a name. Let's see. Hmm. Ah, uh, <laughs> you would name it something like Minty Fresh. I just, I have to do it. <laughs> or how about like, um, uh if facets of a mint uh minty mint mint you know what minty fresh is really hilarious we're gonna go with that he named it minty fresh and he was gonna give it to her as a gift and and here he is suddenly like huh so let's give her a romantic gift of that necklace please because i think he's going to be like whoa what's this and just kind of pull it out <laughs> and she'll take oh, it oh benay yeah, oh, now she's stinky. Hang in there, Ashlyn! She just desperately needs a shower, but there's a lot going down. <sighs> Good. Rocky completed. <laughs> Finally. I'm so relieved. At least he managed to complete the community service day, so he doesn't have to spend a night, like, in the, the community prison. Now what should I do? Should I just kind of let them talk it out? And see how things go? Like, he wants to kiss her? She wants to shower? I'll admit, she isn't exactly the freshest. Geppetto, 
<laughs> do you does does Rocky remember Geppetto before he remembers like Ashlyn? There's a lot going on, sir. And now he's feeling super passionate. He's feeling the love, romantic generosity. Oh my gosh, it's all over the place. You've got a lot of emotions going on. And I also think he's kind of wondering where his cousin Nessa went. I wonder, can I, I can't even text her because she is a ghost. So I'm kind of just still stuck here and he still wants to kiss Ashlyn. Stop eating the cream. Do you know how I suffered for that Geppetto? Do you know how I suffered for this? Okay, look. Like, I'm gonna have to be the bad person. We're gonna have to lecture you about eating the human food. I... I, I hear you, aliens. Are you returning? My ghost. Maybe? Is that... A, I was going to... I don't think I would have cried, but I would have laid down and kind of rocked in place for a minute and been like... It's not my fault. It's not my fault. Everyone says I can't ever stay focused on stuff, even with my new my ADHD medicine. But it's not my fault that there's a vampire here too. I was I was just gonna I would have just needed to lay on the floor for a minute. So is my ghost back? I'm glad that the community um service was successful for everybody. Nessa? Now what happened to you? Are you home? Nessa! Oh my gosh, why are you showing up just as these two have decided to try to remember each other by making out? <laughs> Aww, okay, that was a cute little smooch. I kind of want to see if they just, like hang out with each other for a minute but she wants to go talk to a plant that's not that's not what we're doing here ma'am and i appreciate that he wants to clean things up but we kind of need to settle this whole like who are you thing so here are my thoughts rocky is taking this kind of in stride i think he thinks it's a bit of a joke but i think he might think maybe ashlyn's like a, a fling that he doesn't remember somehow. Maybe it's the sleep depri deprivation of the last few days of raising a newborn. Maybe she's like the really hot nanny or something. Who knows? Rocky, ugh, you're, you're just a bucket of trouble, you are. But he's taking, hanging out with her kind of well. And Ashlyn, I think, feels embarrassed, as we saw, but okay, apparently just mostly flirty, um, about this whole situation. And what we're going to do with her is we are going to say that she actually needs to go back to 6am. So in order to fully restore all of his memories and, and make it so that he can actually remember like, oh yeah, like, I guess we are a, a couple. Like he can recall everything because we've shared too much to forget it all, Rocky. I think we need to go to 6am because there might be something there energy wise plant wise biochemical wise that ashlyn needs in order to restore rocky's memories and in the meantime it's almost like they're dating for the first time so but oh my gosh what I, like a kiss like um can i leap into his arms or something oh uh, let's see how about how about let's see um discuss future together because i think she'd be panicking a little bit and maybe like trying to like uh, fix annoying. this by being like yeah come on you remember me right i totally didn't accidentally wipe your memories right i already couldn't remember what happened before i crash landed and now this and there goes nessa i really if rocky oh that's a huge negative status on their relationship Oh man! Okay, I think she's being a little too like forward or something. What am I gonna do? Now we're talking about fishing spots. So he just thinks that she's like. I think he thinks she's just some sort of like babysitter person who showed up, and she's pretty cute. But like, what's he, she doing in his house? Here, and also, Ashlyn, could you start wearing this minty fresh gemstone that he made for you? And he's like, well, you know, that's kind of a generous gift I gave you, considering I need a bunch of money. Wow, that's really pretty. I really like that. Nice. Um, Considering I need, like, to take care of my kids, but I guess if you're here to be the babysitter, 
Oh my word. I wonder, how could we like restore some of his memories? I get, maybe we just have to go straight to 6am. Erwin, it's an emergency! <laughs> Literally an emergency! Can I upgrade the thing for 6am? Probably. But do I want to haul the whole family over to the, the, the cave at this exact moment? Not really. But I don't... <laughs> uh, okay, maybe Nessa can help. Maybe, okay, if we're done talking to Rocky, when she stops talking to Rocky again, we'll go see if we can work with Nessa. Because if we can get her to come back, maybe we can salvage this relationship with Rocky. Wow, look at those needs fill up. This is broken. All right, if you're done and you want to try to empty trash and stuff. Oh, man. I wonder, like, he, he might try to be a bit of a gentleman and, like, give her, give her the bed if she needs to sleep. Um, but she's rapidly not needing that because, like, her energy is filling up. This is broken, Rocky. I don't know if you should be wearing this ring. Like, maybe I'll just take it as a gift from the simlish, like, cow plant gods right now. The holy cow plant. The literal, huh? Okay, that's it. I'm starting the church of the holy cow plant. That's just too much fun. Um, but maybe it's just a gift for everything else that's going on that I can perhaps... Perhaps at least try to spend a moment with this man. <laughs> Where did I put the other cream? No, please stop putting the... Oh my gosh, please stop putting the cream in there. Oh my gosh, you can't put cream in the fridge. And now I can't put it back in our inventory. In our inventory. Sad. <laughs> so maybe I'll just leave his mood, but what am I going to do? All right, Danessa! Where's Nessa? All right, Nessa. Oh, she's gone. Fooey! No, where's your ghost? Get back over here, Nessa. This is this is too much. Okay, wait, <gasps> wait. We need to reveal that we're an alien. Maybe that'll help. Maybe that'll help. Okay, let's go ahead and remove disguise. Umbra. Why? That's not going to help. That's going to confuse him more. Please, please, less scuba outfit and more, <laughs> more normal outfit, please. Here, you can wear, um, if you want to prove you're an alien, wear your alien outfit, my dear. Please don't wear your scuba outfit right now. And then maybe we can go ahead and, uh, I love you. Maybe she would say that kind of in desperation to be like, but Rocky, because I do think she'd be very distressed on some level that he's forgotten her. Did you really let me or are you saying that? No, really? <laughs> Samzo, <laughs> Okay. Talk about the weather. Oh, you geese. Complain about cloud. Oh my, my gosh, my dear. I guess that's one way to kind of show like being an alien. Okay. Let's see. Think, 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 think. Uh, small talk. Discuss human foods. Oh, and then maybe share a baby picture was a new thing I've not seen before. Um, enthusiasm about upcoming wedding! Okay, we're gonna go ahead and do that. And then maybe brag about the ranch, because, come on. Um, like... Okay, I just heard clomp, 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 and I realized that was Hercules running above. I, I thought for just a second we were gonna have, like, the Headless Horseman on top of this. I might need to lay it down. Alright, so she's chatting with him. He seems to be... Let's talk about the marriage. He seems to be taking it kind of okay. But also, like, alright, what are we going to do about this? Like, alien. He's realizing that, like, uh, behaving like the captain of a space journey from interacting with aliens. So, we got an alien. She's pretty cute. She apparently says that we're supposed to end up, like, marrying her. She's got pictures together. This might just be an alien conspiracy. Please don't talk to Erwin. He will tell you it is an alien conspiracy. This will break the man. Don't stress Erwin out here. Oh. Well. When you're self-assured. And pretty um, self-absorbed. Yeah. Yeah. 
I guess he would think, of course, he's he's hot enough to attract aliens. And I think he's just rolling with this, but I don't think he remembers her. And that's Rocky. I am going to figure out where we're going to go from here. <laughs> he doesn't seem to be too perplexed or upset by the situation. <laughs> maybe we can go ahead and have him kind of like assess the ranch or even maybe now he could spend a little bit of time hanging out with Hercules. <laughs> can we, can we, I don't know if he'd want to go for a ride when he's not even friends with her right now. Because I feel like he'd be worried about leaving his girls with a stranger, but I think maybe he also thinks that she's the babysitter. So... You know what? While we can, let's go for an energetic ride while he's feeling, like, all romantic and distracted, but also doesn't remember her. <laughs> his fiance, who might also be the alien mother of his twins, and... I think it's really ironic that as we focus on Rocky, you can see the picture of them together. A younger Rocky with no beard. The beard's grown on me. <laughs> uh, literally grown on him, but also grown on me. Um, I think we'll let him go and he'll remember Hercules. Because at least having so much of his memory wiped of a very important key facet of his life means that poor Hercules might finally get a corner of his brain, Rocky's brain. To go ahead and um and be paid attention to just in time by the way because you know since nessa is still missing sir i don't remember giving you that outfit <sighs> yeah i'm pretty sure he figures he's just the main character he's got main character syndrome And I guess I'm the only one distressed about this situation. And Ashlyn. And this is hilarious. We'll let him go out on that nice moonlit country ride, talking to his horse that he suddenly remembers he needs to do competitions with. He's going to get an interesting notice that every day he's not doing community, well, at least a couple days a week, if he doesn't do a competition with Hercules, people are going to start looking for Nessa. And I will roll... Um, a randomizer to see if like the the sims in black are going to use that as a excuse to go ahead and try to track down ashlyn on his land we might see if the sheriff might poke around we might see if rocky gets in more trouble somehow or he has to start paying huge fines that nessa was handling for him because she's still missing I, we'll have to see if maybe her her business empire for the environmental movement starts crumbling and we have to fix it somehow or maybe we'll get really lucky and we'll be able to revive her soon. <laughs> but all of that next time. I, I'm going to make Ashlyn stop smelling the garbage. <sighs> and, and, and we'll take it one step at a time. This is amazing. My ghost got abducted.